On December 31st, 2019, Kenyans celebrated the onset of a new year with high expectations. Little did anyone know that 2020 would suffer due to the coronavirus pandemic that continues to crumble economies world over. Nine months later, and the effects can still be felt. Umoja Market, where hundreds of women go to get their hair done. The market is usually a beehive of activities on Christmas Eve, but today the script is different. We have a market for 20 years. Na niki kompia mambo na biashara ya last year na this year. Last year kulikuwa na job sana. Kama sayi hata tulikuwa tupumziki, tulikuwa up and down, up and down, up and down. Unapata uko na customer, hata customers wengine wanaenda juu, vile wako wengi. This time hakuna kazi, hata, hata, hata. Hata saizi ukiangalia, unapata tuko na customer mmoja mmoja. Hii msimu ya Christmas, si venye tulikuwa tunategemea, tulikuwa gana kazi. But sayi, hakuna hiyo kazi mingi, but kuna hile kidogo tunafanya. In Isili market where most Kenyans opt to buy shopping due to affordability of commodities, turnout was below traders' expectations. <laughs> Businesses had to reduce prices in order to attract more customers. Last year, my customers were very young, but this year, uh, my customers were very young, my customers were very young, my customers The customers, they don't have it money. We reduce for the price. Uh, we look for our customers, they don't have it money, the Christmas, it's coming, they say we have it only this and this and this, we make it for low. Majority of Kenyans have been forced to cut their spending as financial constraints bite. Kama last year, tulikuwa tunashop vizuri, pesa ilikuwa, lakini saai, pesa imekuwa chini sana. The few that chose to travel up country remained stranded due to hiked fare. Naenda nyumbani, nimekaa hapa kwa ajili ya fare. Fare iko juu. Na sasa na nafikiria ikiendelea hivyo narudi nyumbani. Leo ni the 24. Leo tunalipisha 3000 mtu mmoja. Kwa sababu ya social distance pia, alafu pia ni mbali. So gari ibebi watu wenyewe inafaa kubeba watu 67 but inabeba watu 30 size. So naona ndio maana pia fare imepanda. This is a Christmas season that most Kenyans will live to remember, owing that the country has grappled with harsh economic times brought about by the pandemic. Nonetheless, the festive mood is almost not felt. As witnessed on the ground, Mombi Wambogo K24, Isili Market, Nairobi.